going to do some one guitar. Uh, hey. thanks, everybody. thanks so much for coming out tonight, everybody. Right. Yeah. The, the, uh, I love coming down here, you know, see, uh, this, this is one, this is one, uh, you know, talk about American treasures. Look at this place. Yeah. You know, the, the, the ambiance of the feel. Buddy Holly would like this place. He would. I mean, this is a real thing. And uh, it's, I know, I know many people who come to play here, and they get an incredible list of people, and and uh, everybody loves it, you know. From Robert Gordon to David Johansson to uh, uh, Gary Bonds is coming. I mean, I mean, has Bruce has Bruce played here yet? <laughs> I'll tell Bruce about this. Bruce will love it. It's a real thing. This is a song off of the Innocent Ones. This song is called One Guitar, and it's a song about. I wrote this with Frankie, thank you. It's about, about what one guitar and one voice can do to help make things better in the world. It's a tough old world, but you know, you do every little bit you can. And I, the tradition of uh, uh, people with one guitar, Woody Guthrie, uh, Pete Seeger, Dylan Springsteen, it, it, there's, there's more to come, you know. It's, there's, it's, you can raise people's spirits. And uh, this is one guitar, there's a, there's a website called oneguitar.org. We've got this one guitar campaign and um, one of my managers, it was his idea, he said let's get 30 or 40 people to record this song and let's put them all up on iTunes and have to put all the money to go to charity. I said it's okay with me, you know, all the, all the money that, it, that is earned by that will go to charity for the, the benefit versions and uh, a bunch of people recorded it, Graham Parker did it, The Alarm did it, Jesse Mallon's going to do a version, Eric Bazilian uh, told me last week he was going to do a version. And there's this website called ReverbNation.com. It's kind of like a MySpace for bands. They help bands market. There's over a million bands. And the president, the guy that owns that, is buddies with my manager and a huge fan. And he, they're going to put in the front page of this website. So instead, instead of being 30 or 40 artists, they're looking to get a couple thousand. And they're looking to break the Guinness Book of World Records with the most recorded song of all time. Right now, a, any guesses the most recorded song of all time? It's yesterday. It's like oh, a, wow. it's, it's over fifteen hundred versions. <laughs> McCartney's song, yeah, and and uh, so you know, I, if it gets close, I'm gonna I'm gonna get a message to Paul. Hey, Paulie, break your own record. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's 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 a it's a good day. So this is uh, I'll sing it for you. This is uh, it sounded much like this one we wrote. Uh, I wrote this with Frank, and um, you can sing on this. We did it all over Europe, and. Uh, it's, it's fun to sing. Anyway, I'm excited about it. We'll see what happens. But it's a good idea if we raise money. Half the, all the money. Let's see. There's an organization called the T.J. Martell Foundation. It's the biggest. Can, it's the biggest record business charity. They raise like nine nine hundred million for it. It's for cancer research. So half the money is going to go to T.J. Martell. The other half goes to the uh, charity of the artist choice. We've got about half a dozen of them up at this one guitar.org site. So hopefully we we'll raise a lot of money for cancer. Break the record world. The Guinness Book of World Records most recorded song. Then we can all go down to uh, Jester's and have a drink and start calling it Jasper's. Okay. Anyway, without further ado. Na 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 Oh 
Thanks everybody.